so you want to take photos of the moon, stars, planets, whatever. If you already have a telescope and a DSLR, taking photos is really easy to do. All you need is two pieces. First, you need what is known as a T-ring. This is specific to what type of camera you have. So if you have a Canon camera, you need a T-ring that is made for Canon cameras. Second, you're going to need a T-adapter. This is specific to your telescope. It's possible for the same adapter to be compatible with many different telescopes, so you should search online and see which one is compatible with yours. You should be able to find one pretty easily on Amazon by searching for your telescope model and T-adapter. Once you have all the pieces you're going to need, you want to take the existing lens off the camera. Now you can mount the T-ring on your camera as if it were a lens. Now pick up your T-adapter and make sure the threads on the end are facing towards the telescope so that you can mount on your telescope later. Now you can screw the other end of the T-adapter into the T-ring. Now that you have everything set up for the camera, you can take the eyepiece assembly off your telescope. You should be able to unscrew this ring right here, and then it'll come right off. Now you can mount the camera on the telescope the same way the eyepiece assembly attached. And now you should be ready to take pictures. Now be careful, if you have your telescope automatically finding objects for you, you need to make sure that the camera is not going to run into the bottom piece here. Once you find your object, you're going to need to focus, so that is a minor inconvenience. When you are focusing, there is likely going to be a difference between the focus for your eyes and the focus for your camera, so if you're switching back and forth, you're going to need to keep that in mind. And that's about it. Please make sure to take into account all other safety precautions that you need to do anyway while you're using a telescope, and then you should be good to go. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you again soon with another video.